I want to defend my WWE Championship against John Cena. Beating him would solidify my title reign and put me up there with some of the top champions of all time. So, any chance you can make that happen? You know, maybe give him one of those mandates to show up and face me? Yeah, I wish it was that easy. I mean, don't you think I've already tried to get Cena to appear on Raw before? He would bring instant star power along with a guaranteed ratings boost. But the reality is he's busy with various TV and film projects and isn't interested in a return right now. So it's pretty much a lost cause. If I were you, I'd focus on something else. I wouldn't be where I am today if I just quit anytime I was up against some adversity. I'm going to get John Cena to come back to WWE and face me. And how are you going to do that? I'm going to take a little trip down memory lane and revisit some of Cena's career highlights. Maybe that will get his attention. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from El Paso, Texas. Weighing in at 272 pounds, the WWE Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. This former indie star learned the hard way that success in the ring yesterday doesn't guarantee glory the next. Respect must be earned. And he got a PhD in respect thanks to training with Booker T. If you test the two-time WWE Hall of Famer and five-time WCW champion, you're definitely gonna learn some tough lessons. It's this simple for the champ. Win no matter what the stakes are. Now here's a man, The Miz, who is one of the most accomplished stars in the history of WWE. Just one of the many reasons why he is the A-lister. And his opponent from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz! Already such a, a WWE and Hollywood success. But the thing about Miz is he always wants more. Yeah, and the Miz will stoop to any level to get more. It works, doesn't it? The Red Brand's rolling out the red carpet tonight as the current WWE Champion has invited none other than The Miz to Monday Night Raw to square off one-on-one. -on -one. It's a heck of a gambit, Michael, using The Miz to provoke one of WWE's greatest champions of all time, John Cena. And it's a gambit that could easily blow up in the WWE Champion's face. Standing Spanish Flyer, are you kidding me? Incredible. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip, now oh, into a power bomb. Yeah, he's putting something together. Check their face after that one. The man is looking a little startled right now. Oh, Miz turns the tables. Now Miz looking for some momentum. Could be what he needed to ignite a rally. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. 
The Miz at the complete mercy of his opponent. Not looking so awesome for Miz here. Countered it just in time. These two showing how well Scott pay each other. Back and forth from these competitors. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. So this whole Cena thing, hate to say I told you so, but you know what? I don't hate it at all. I told you so. I know how it looks from your perspective, but I promise it's going to work. I just need more time. And besides, I never said this would be easy. Fine, but if you don't get at least some kind of acknowledgement soon from Cena, then I'm pulling the plug. What's your next move? Spotlighting a major loss didn't seem to work, so I'm going to go in the other direction. Oh yeah, I actually got wind of your idea for this already. Trying to replicate Cena's first WWE Championship win by beating JBL? Don't think it's going to matter, but I'll make it happen. Hey, Hall of Famer! And our former broadcast colleague, guys, a wrestling god. And his opponent from Dallas, Texas, weighing in at 290 pounds, J.B. Hill. One of the longest reigning champions of the ruthless aggression era yeah his personal wealth only matched by his wealth of wrestling knowledge inside the squared circle i'm surprised at this point saxton that john hasn't paid you just to stay away come on secretly john loves me
One of the best brawlers in WWE history. Hey, Corey, you think JBL will pay the medical facility bills for his opposition tonight? Fresh off a big win against The Miz, the WWE Champion will try to get John Cena's attention one more time tonight against one of Cena's former WrestleMania foes, JBL. JBL, the Hall of Famer that can still go in the ring and has a Hall of Fame boost to boot. Give that butt kiss and a rest, Saxton. I'm just dating facts, Corey. What a forearm! Got him set up in a... Such an incredible matchup. You, you get the sense he's willing to do whatever it takes to put this match in the books. Because I think the realization is beginning to creep in. He may have to do something spectacular. He may have to reach deep into his playbook to figure something out to earn a win. Oh, my God. Here it comes. Oh, oh my God. Climbing the turnbuckle now. From the heavens. Legs go numb. Oh, that'll send a shock down your spine. Bradshaw struggling to defend himself. JBL has to gather the energy to turn the tables. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Uh oh. Way too far. Nobody home. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Now trampling the opposition. Oh, that might have just broken something. This one is headed outside, guys. And back in the ring we go. JBL able to avoid impact. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Gosh. Enough already. He's certainly looking in command at the moment. Keeping the pressure on. Oh, the reversal by JBL. JBL managing to find some much-needed breathing room. Could be just what JBL needed to battle back in this one. Oh. JBL could be moments away from being beaten. He has a hold of JBL. Down. Can JBL come back from that? Second row. Oh, that might be the best move so ever. I agree. Two. two. He kicks out at two. He just won't give up. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. JBL isn't being given any room to recover. JBL has to gather the energy to turn the tables. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. Up high. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. From the middle rope, breathtaking hurricane run. Fortune favors the bowl. These risks could be a winning strategy. Oh, to the arm. Terrible. He just isn't being given any room to recuperate. He somehow has to get himself back in order again. He catches JBL with a counter.
there was a potential opening with Cena, and you blew it. I don't think it's over. Are you crazy? He turned you down and then you insulted him? We can forget about a match. He probably won't even come back for a simple appearance now. So thanks for that. I'm telling you, I think I struck a nerve with him. And a man like that is too proud to just let that go. Let me do one more thing to get his attention, and if this doesn't work, then I'll move on. You've already tried one more thing two or three times. He's going to respect the fact that I won't give up. And then you'll get your star power and your ratings boost that you want so bad. Ugh, what do you want to do? I want The Undertaker. What? Let me explain. Cena was in the exact same position I'm in with The Undertaker a few years ago at WrestleMania. He was so desperate for a match he bought a ticket and sat in the audience waiting. When Undertaker eventually did appear, Cena lost in five minutes. I remember all that. What's your point? I want to send Cena a final message by doing what he couldn't do at WrestleMania. I want to defeat The Undertaker. That's really pushing it, but I think I can make it happen. And if Cena sticks to his word and never answers your challenge, then at least I'll get the ratings boost I was looking for with The Undertaker. And if Cena does change his mind, then even better. All right. Looks like you got yourself a match against the Phenom. The WWE Champion has been on a roll, but tonight the champ will have to take his game to an entirely new level as he takes on the incomparable WWE legend, The Undertaker. It's the WWE Champion versus the Dead Man on Raw. This is huge. I have a feeling that even John Cena is going to be taking a break from his busy Hollywood schedule to watch this one. That's certainly the champion's plan. Let's see if it works. right back with a reversal. Oh, uh, hits him with the counter. Bad predicament right here. Oh, dropped right on their face. Somehow he saw Taker coming. Running Hurricane Rana. Stomping. Ouch. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. All measured up. Ah, oh, drop kick to the spine. He's taking some good hits. Destructive arm breaker. Bang! The dead man facing some danger. Undertaker's really being tested here. Knee strike to the face. Something's about to go either very wrong or very right. tonight for the WWE Champion over the Phenom himself, The Undertaker. You never want to overlook an accomplishment like that, but I think the champion still has other things on his mind. John Cena, over the past few weeks, I've done everything I can to prove to you that I'm worthy of a match that I'm worthy of your time. I mean, I just beat The Undertaker, which is something you couldn't do. So you know what? Maybe, maybe I've been looking at this the wrong way. Maybe it's not about proving that I'm worthy of your time. Maybe you're not worth mine. I have to agree with the WWE Champion here. It's time to move on from this whole John Cena thing. Wait a second. It's John Cena! The face of WWE has come home! I can't believe it. After weeks of unanswered challenges, and then Cena himself saying it wasn't going to happen, the WWE Champion has gotten John Cena to return to Monday Night Raw.
And there you have it. Cena is back for one thing, the WWE Championship. Hey, this is a matchup that no one thought we'd ever see. And now it looks like it's happening. This is going to be one for the ages. As a reminder, the title is on the line here in this match. And the champ is certainly going to have an uphill battle, that's for sure. As far as title defenses go, this is about as big as it gets. He needs to be on his game tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, when you think of WWE, you think of John Cena. Loved by many, resented by some, but respected by all. Time to do it one time again. Let's go to work. Listen to this place. Since 2003, I don't know if any other superstar has defined WWE in the same way as John Cena. Yeah, a man who's been defined by his passion, a man who's been defined by his work ethic, and a man who has been defined by Hall of Fame success here in WWE. The greatest of all time, John Cena, set for action here tonight. Byron, you should strive to be more like John Cena. I do. Arguably the biggest star in WWE history and, well, on his way to becoming the biggest star, perhaps in Hollywood, too. Introducing the challenger Mr. McMahon is the from West Newberry, Massachusetts, WWE. weighing in at there 251 pounds, not accomplished John in sports Cena. entertainment. Michael, it's got to feel like yesterday for you when you saw John Cena win his first WWE Championship by the And introducing the champion at from El Paso, Texas, Texas. Weighing in at 272 pounds. He is the WWE Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. The stakes could not be any higher. It is time for our WWE Championship match. Weeks of grueling battles have all led the WWE Champion to this moment. A chance to etch his name into the WWE history books against the one and only John Cena. Talk about box office. Two of the biggest draws in sports entertainment are fighting for the right to call themselves the true face of WWE. You want to talk faces? The WWE Champion finally got his wish. A chance to carve his mug right up there onto WWE's Mount Rushmore. Oh no, oh, the reverse DDT. Oh, did you see? 
see that? Uh-oh. Oh, are you kidding me? Back of his neck. An uninterrupted surge against Cena here. Cena's just trying to weather the storm. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip. Now, oh, into a powerbomb. And Cena with the wherewithal of the counter. Oh my God, it did he too. Spiked them. Great reversal. Oh, and a reversal. Series of reversals. And he's just flying his skills now. He's got to boost up his levels of aggression at this point. Caving in the abdomen. The challenger is not in a great place. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Cena's out of it. John's in peril here. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Legs caught. Reciprocating the initial reversal. There's a swing blade. And a basement drop kick. Cena now taking the brunt of the attack. Cena needs to find yeah. some energy fast. Can't prepare your face for that. Is it. And Cena puts a quick stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. Could be what Cena needed to ignite a rally. Oh, snake eyes caving in their face. He went right into that turnbuckle. He's positioned up on that turnbuckle. I would not want to be him right now. Introducing the challenger from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! And introducing the champion from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 272 pounds, he is the WWE Champion! The Enforcer, 
Brandon Gutierrez. It is the richest prize our industry has to offer. This is the WWE Championship. Welcome to what should be one of the most brutal championship matches we've ever seen between the defending WWE Champion and one of the most decorated superstars in WWE history. John Cena as they face off in a last man standing match. That means that one of these two extraordinary athletes will need to keep the other down for a full 10 count to walk out of here tonight with the title. It's hard enough keeping Cena down for a three count, let alone 10. Let's see if the WWE Champion has what it takes to pull it off. What's he got in mind here? Lands face first. Cena is unable to stop this string of offense. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. Oh, wow. Frankensteiner. Nice. Oh my god! Oh, you are you kidding, kidding me? The back of his neck. Oh, from behind. Oh my god, inverted Frankensteiner. What's he gonna do here? Oh my goodness. Jam your leg in a bad way. Stump puller leg snap, very effective. And now he's just being pushed around. He's just on the wrong side of every maneuver. Face first. He catches Cena with a counter. And Zagiri finds his mark. on top of reversal. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Boom! A forearm smack! Ooh, forearm connects. Knees, knee, face. Pulls the rip cord. Knee strike to the face. Uh-oh, look out. Uninterrupted surge against Cena here. Cena perseverance being tested. Uh-oh. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. So much damage inflicted. Nice counter by Cena. Crucial turnaround there because Cena was throwing the head. Cena's never give up attitude shining through once again. Able to give him the slip. Right now, I just don't know what it's going to take. Into the turnbuckle. Setting him up for something here. And whatever it is, it's... You know what, guys? I was afraid it was going to get to this point. starting to falter here. Cena needs to find some energy fast. Boom! Basement drop kick. Well measured. Strikes with a kick. And Cena's able to win. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. Cena's looking absolutely powerless. He's going for it all. Champ.
Now you gotta dig deep. Eight, nine, ten. Retains the title. Here is your winner, and still the WWE Champion, the Enforcer, Brandon Gutierrez. This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation.